Hi guys, it's Tampa Tech, and I'm going to show you three different ways to bypass your lock screen on your Android phone. There's a fourth way, but it's kind of lengthy and you have to use a computer. But if you want to know that way, post a comment below. I'll go ahead and do that video for you guys. Um, but just give me like maybe a couple days to make that video. All right, but this is three ways to bypass your lock screen on your Android phone. So I'll go ahead and show you. So right here, there's your pattern lock. And say you try it once. And you try it twice. And you try it three times. Four times. Five times. Or maybe six times. But anyway, it says you have incorrectly done your pattern. Um, and hit OK. And this will come up now. This will pop up on your screen forgot password. Click on that. Now it's going to give you a couple options. You could do your pin, if you remember your pin. One, two, three, four. Hit done. Hit OK. And then we're back in. And then you can um, redo your pass, uh, pattern. OK. Continue. So we're redoing. It's resetting your pattern. One, two, three, four. Continue. Done. Done, damn it. Oh, confirm. Yeah, and there we're in. Alright, I'm going to show you the second way. Okay, let's say you try it again once, twice, three times, four times, five times. It's important to do that five times or else you're not going to get this pop-up right here, forgot password. Click on that. Alright, now from this point on, you can use your email address and password for your email address that you use to set up your phone, your Android phone or your tablet. And you should hopefully know your email address, your Gmail, you know, blah 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 at gmail.com and then that password. Now this is the third way I'm going to show you. Third way you might have to try a couple times. You hold the power button down. You hold the power button down for about 10 seconds. All right. Keep on holding it down. Keep on holding the power button down, and then it force shuts it down. Then hit power and volume down. When you hit power and volume down, it should come come up to a reset screen. But it probably won't come up to a reset screen because, uh, it's, oh my god, I got lucky. Sometimes it, t it takes me like two or three tries to do this, by the way. So if it doesn't work the first time, try, try again. Factory reset, it says. Right, factory hard reset. Permanently erase user data and reset settings. Now, if your phone's messing up on you, it's glitchy, I would recommend doing that. Um, but at first, always do a regular reset by holding down the power button. That's a soft reset. Thanks guys for watching, post a comment, subscribe to Tampa Tech for new simple fixes and check out my other YouTube videos how to fix TVs and tablets and computers and how to install TVs on the wall and surround sound, stuff like that. Thanks guys.